Let's talk about Tenari operators in JavaScript. Well, Tenari operators are the same way you can actually write your conditional statement in JavaScript without all the if else statement. Uh, if you take a look into my code right now, you see, for example, we have a function that says get name. It checks if the data is happy, then we return the name. Otherwise, we return undefined. If you take a look at my data, I have name is Ola and is happy is equal to false. And this function is going to return undefined. But did you know that we can do exactly the same thing without actually writing this much code? And uh, the way we can do that is say we say function, we can say get name using binary, and then we say inside of our function we just say return data dot is happy. The, the condition on our right of our binary uh, function is basically going to be the condition that we are using to check in this case, which is going to be is this particular person happy? And then we say question mark. If they are happy, yeah, then we want to return data.name. We use the column to say the otherwise statement. So else statement in this case, otherwise we want to return what? We want to return undefined. This function that we have below here and this function are exactly the same thing. They will return exactly the same thing. So instead of writing six or seven lines of code, we can just write three lines of code and we get exactly the same thing. To make sure that our function is working as expected, let's test it out. So first of all, we're going to log get name. Uh, if we say node index.jx, we get undefined. And now we are going to log get tenary. If we run that, we are also going to get undefined, right? So now let's change is happy to true to see how that's going to work. If we say node index.js, we get Ola. If we do the same thing for get name, node index.js, we get Ola. That's it, guys. That's how you write a tenary operator in JavaScript. And see you on the next one.